Hey YouTube, tribute to the Gabriel here. Um, I went to regionals uh, this last weekend, and well, there's some things I'm gonna talk about. I'm gonna show my main deck, my black wing deck, and extra deck, side deck, and some other cards. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, first thing, giant runet. It has to be banned. They are there are not really many responses to a giant true nade. I mean you could run Dark Bright, but it gives a disadvantage. Um they might just draw some other card who rapes that rapes everything. Um Netherland Catastrophe didn't ever get to play it. Um but I wanted to. And spell shedding error, I found these guys too late. Um, found it in my maps. Um, should have played it. It could really have won me, pretty much. I went three, four, three wins, four lose. But I am one hundred percent sure of that I could have won. Uh, two uh, of of those games, um, if I didn't misplay. Um, I misplayed very bad because. I just played this deck again. It's ages ago. I played it. Um, but I could have won very easily if I had played right. Um, okay, for the main deck, two Vios. Three Blizzards. Still good at three. Draw this. Um, if you have Black Willand out, search for Vio. And get a Bryanak. Dump Vio for one Synchro or whatever. And it's awesome to top deck this guy. Um, Gale, Kalut. Still three Boras. Um, it's just a special summon and you can easily make with Shura a special summon Bora attack, get Vayu out on the field and make Trishula. I made it almost every game. Um, three Shura. Only Two, Sirocco. I don't find it good at three because I had many hands um, when you, when I tested it, where I had like two of them on my hand and couldn't use them for anything. Um, instead, I play one DD Crew. Um, really good against many decks, plants, special, and six amps a bit. And yeah, um, Morphing Jar. Um, just good. Um, I got to use it once only. The other times I didn't draw it or I sided it out. Um, that time it was an easy win because I just did. I just uh, did Icarus pop his monsters, and he set one back row. So he had like he had three cards in his hand. Flipped. I had nothing. Got five extra, and one. On that because I got gores out and whatever so <clears throat> really changes the game when you get to to flip it in your own turn um, which I think is is very possible in black wings because of all the traps that you run um, one spirit reaper it's just good and uh, the third Sirocco I changed for Thunder King Ryo um, I think it's really good just anti-meta and yeah Stops your opponent from adding cards in your hand. The only thing you got is Black Willand that adds cards to your hand in this deck, so so it doesn't hurt yourself so much. Um, and your opponent has to waste resources to get away with, like a, a bottomless trap hole. Um, yeah. Um, Dagon Dragon and Gorse for the last monsters, um, for obvious reasons. I misplayed on these two. Um, really bad. Twice. Um, didn't think right when I played, so... Yeah. <clears throat> For the traps. Two Icarus attack. And one Delta Crow. And never got to use this. Never. Um, sided it out after the first few matches because it was kind of waste it didn't see it in ha coming handy anyway because plants don't run many and yeah compulsory evacuation device at two um 
it's really good it can, it's chainable so that's why i run it um like all those scraps i actually feared scrap really much um but i misplayed very badly at the scrap duel um but these are really good because when they pop one to target this you activate and uh, it's his tra scrap dragon goes back um, not to the graveyard like they want to um one trap stun and one seven tools um i didn't like the idea of two seven tools because sometimes you just want to make sure to stop every trap not just one um yeah torrential tribute of course silent judgment and one warning um really saved me a lot every time i got this uh, the solemn warning it saved me um i actually only used the uh, judgment once um and it didn't do much of a difference so yeah no comment on that one um one bottomless trap hole for the last trap um spells for obvious reasons you run one black whirlwind two mst actually one uh, big mystery uh, mistake uh people made was they didn't use mst on my black whirlwind i won on this card you have to destroy it as soon as you can because else it gives too much advantage to the black wing player well uh two mst one sort of reeling light sided it out never really helped me um don't know i should have played spell shattering shattering error instead people were siding um uh the dark imprisoning mirror uh, for grave keepers so so i got kind of i i went uh it went okay with those also still don't get why people cite the little thing the consecrated light because it's easy to run around it um because you soon crow so much like the mind control um dark hole monster reborn and book of moon obvious Uh, for the extra deck, got the staples, um, Contesta, Android, Brionac, two armed wing. I tried one uh, when I tested it f uh, for a few days ago, but I really don't like it. Um, you know, with those values, you make one of them and then it's, it's gone. Um, I actually misplayed on this one too. Could have won the last one also, so I would have gone... Six, uh, six, one, and maybe went to top. If I didn't misplay in this, I should have synchroed to this uh, one instead of Brionac, but it wasn't time, so um, out in time I played one uh, pr pretty annoying little guy. Um, he uh, made us go into time, and I got stressed. Um, yeah. One guy a night, just really good, can hit over many things. Um, one ancient fairy never got to use it. Never played. Yeah, I played Gravekeepers once, but it was after I had lost a match, so it was easy to win um, even without it. Um, Black Rose Dragon didn't use it. Um, two armed, uh, armor master the same thing with armed wing. Um, like to play two. Only one stardust. One thought ruler, never used it. One scrap dragon, never used it. Um, one silver wind, never used it. But when I tested uh, the deck, I used this to win once, so it's good. Um, but I'll probably change the the thought ruler archfiend to another trishula because it's easy to make it. Um, like I said, so for the side deck, I ran one DD crow. Um, just for more removal. Um, one purple plant, never used it. Um, could have sighted it out. Two kinetic soldier. As I said, I thought I would get over against many 6Ms, but never played one. Um, so kind of useless. One Thunder King, more. Um, yeah, against Sabres and whatever, but never played those two. 
Um, two light imprisoning mirror. Never really got to use this one. Also, um, there were quite a few uh, who played the agent angels, um, and there were worms too. So, but didn't use it. Um, ghost and match. I would have won on this one if not giant trunate would have um, would have ripped my face off. I, I felt like violated from behind. Um, he just went giant trunate. I had book of moon, bottomless treple, and ghost and match down, um, and he was a plant player. Um, I could so easily have won that game if he didn't have giant trunate. It's a Seki card. Um, yeah. But uh, that was the only one I lost fair. Uh, the others I misplayed to bad. Revelry, Revelry of the Warlords. Um, really good card. Um, helped me once to win. Dimensional Fissure. Um, again, uh, when I was in time, I had the perfect setup. Um, but Giant Trunate ripped my face, I had Dimensional Fissure up and and full back row and whatever. Um, it's easy to play around it for Black Wings, you just get the the good the Synchros out and if you have a Ghost Match or, or Rivalry out on the field, your opponent can't do much. Um, yeah, last but not least, Too Closed Forest um, helped me a bit, but not much. As I said, I only went up against one Gravekeeper. Didn't really help me much um, because I won so easily. Um, well, it's the deck. Um, two spell shortening error. Have to run them. Um, and if I didn't have had misplayed so much, I would have won. I misplayed on DD Crow, um, Gorse, and Dagam Dragon. So it's it's really those cards you have on the hand. You have to to look very good, and you have to to stay calm um, to win games. Um, thanks for watching.